Hi everyone, it's Dees from Turtle Dove. Hope everyone's doing really well. It's a hot day, or it has been a hot day here um, in Australia. It's going to get very hot um, by the weekend. Um, it's Thursday at the moment, although this will probably be going up the next couple of days. Um, normally when I record, I don't put it up on the same day. I edit separately on the desktop. Uh, using a video editor so that all takes time but anyway um, yeah, it's going to get to 39 40 degrees celsius um, Friday and Saturday so summer is here I am here with a, a spotlight haul today and just a couple of things from Audi but just before I show you those products I just want to thank Carlette, a lovely viewer of mine who is very thoughtful um, and she sent me a beautiful card, a Disney card, so thank you for that Carlette and look at this, this is mine and it's a smaller bottle and I've got two of them, I was blown away because these are expensive in Australia. Um, and I've been working on some glitter ornaments and just doing, how many have I done? That will, I'll show you that in a project share coming up next, but I've probably made about 10 and I've almost used this up just for that project. So I was so happy to have received this love it thank you very much it's really appreciated oopsie and over there. also yay glossy accents and it's a big bottle too i've got a small one and i've been savoring it there's not much left um but now i can breathe easy and use it as i wish <laughs> so thank you carlette that was very lovely of you Okay, so on to the spotlight haul. Look at the bag you get with it. Well, you've got to pay for it, but I thought I would pick a Christmas bag. Very pretty. So I've just got a few things from Spotlight because they had 40% off quite a lot of products. And that's when I like to buy is when there are sales. So I'll start off with these two now what are they called activity jars I could probably make my own up to be honest but now I did put a price underneath so I don't have to search on the receipt $3.50 and uh, my two older granddaughters they love collecting rocks and crystal rocks as well um, very special but they don't get to play with them a lot only if their mum is around um, for obvious reasons but I thought I would buy these jars for them to put their precious rocks in this one you decorate into a butterfly and it's got all the items inside and this one is going to be a bee so I thought that was really cool and uh, every once a week I always take one of the granddaughters and um, just have a couple of hours with them one on one. Um, so that's what I'll be doing with my older granddaughter tomorrow. We'll be doing the bumblebee for her and the week after I'll do this one for the other. So I didn't think that was too bad for 350. They have other craft items there that you can do, but the children need to be a lot older. And in fact, I think this is five plus, but I'll be doing this with her. And um, yeah, like I said, they'll be supervised when they do play with this. So that's that. Uh, I mentioned I don't have my big Christmas tree up this year because of my granddaughters. Um, they're so little, um, there's a 16 month old as well and a 5 month old as well as a 3 and almost 4 year old so um, I'm not taking out all my precious ornaments and things so I've got this nice black tree 
but it needs some more gold and some more bling on it so I thought I would buy this star tinsel and that was some um, 40% off so that that was two dollars forty each so I bought two of those Um, and they were 40% off too, $2.50 each. Um, actually, it was 50% off because uh, that's normally $5 each. So I got the silver, I got the gold, and I got the um, iridescent. You can see the green coming through. And I think there's 10 metres to each of these. So that's pretty good. That is pretty good. So um, they only had Christmas colours, which was these and then the red and, red and green. So um, maybe there'll be some left closer to Christmas and they'll be further marked down. But this is all I've got for now. I bought this uh, 1.8 metres. Um, they didn't have, uh, yeah, this was 1.8 and that's how you buy it. Um, they didn't have it by the metre, they were out. I couldn't find any pearls anywhere. And this one is a little bit bigger than I want, wanted, but it's still good. Um, and that was $6, that was quite expensive, so... Um, yeah, they're, they're down on a lot of stock, being close to Christmas too. But I needed that for my ornaments in the future and the ones that I've just been making. I bought some of this plastic, um, opaque plastic trim. And that was $3, down from 6 and there's like one and a half meters in that. I've got another couple of colors, so I've been slowly buying them up. But this, these are the only colors that are on sale. So oh, I think I got the pink and a yellow previously. So and I bought these beads, pastel colored, and they were five dollars. And I might try my hand at melting them down um, to make some drops. But they would be also good for, you know, beading and things. And I haven't got the pastel colours. I don't have a real lot of beads, but I don't do a real lot of good beads, so it'll be nice to have those. I bought this iron-on transfer. Uh, now what was that? Two dollars fifty. Quite big, and I thought I could put. Um, I'll put it on a t-shirt. I'll probably buy black t-shirt or a burgundy coloured t-shirt. I'd love to get white, but it's not practical, especially on Christmas Day with so much food around. And I find that white clothing is so see-through, and a lot of the quality isn't that good of clothes um, they're very see-through and thin so I thought I might go for the black and once I iron this on I can glue some jammies to it and that'll be nice on Christmas Day I've got another t-shirt from last year um, that I can wear too over the Christmas period so that'll be fun to make and these acrylic gems were $11. I've got three packets. Um, absolutely beautiful. Just all colours and they have the mermaid hearts circles, just the normal regular gems 
all in different colours. It's funny, isn't it? When you take them out, they always end up upside down. <laughs> but they, they've got blues and purples and a mixture of clears and sort of blues with the pinks together. So I, I'm going to have plenty of gems because not only do I have this one, I have this one and I pulled some out to show you. So they're different shapes, rectangle, square, like a raindrop, oval, round and the small ones. But look at the colours, absolutely gorgeous. And I love these over here because they're pink and orange together. Some are more orange, others are more pink, like a deep pink. And then others are sort of a mixture of both of them. So I've got that. Look at that, that's going to take me a while to get through. And then I bought this one. Take a couple out for you. You can have a look. Now these are all the same colour, but some have more of a blue tint, a yellow gold tint, and a purple tint to it. And there's different shapes as well. Look at that sparkle. There's more of a green one. So yeah, I guess they're not really the same colour, are they? <laughs> look at that blue. They sort of look the same in the box, but they are different. So that'll keep me busy. So that is it, I think, for spotlight. While I'm here, I did my grocery shop today from Audi and I have some Christmas, Christmas um, gift wrapping and tinsel out there at the moment and lots of glues, glittery glues and markers and things like that just for wrapping. Um, and I've got these tags, these Disney tags. So I thought they would be good in the future. I don't know if I'll get to use this this year. Maybe I will. But um, I can cut things out or I could put a jemmy on top of the hole there where the tag is or I can actually attach that to a project or a card. Just lots of things you can do with that and I thought that was cute. So I got that. That was $3. And the other thing I bought were these two big canvases. Um, there'll be a couple of project chairs coming up soon and when we had lockdown, which only lasted half the amount of time it was supposed to due to Tracers finding out that um, somebody lied about where they'd been. So they, um, anyway, you may have heard it on the news and you may not have, but I did some painting the first three days and I'll show you that but I need some more canvases because I really enjoyed the painting. I um, watched a couple of tutorials and followed them so I'll be talking about that in my next project chair video but these two uh, they were seven dollars and they're both 50 by 40 centimeters and I've got the, the back like that and then you can hang it straight on the wall so that's the type of canvas that you can paint the sides as well so that's it guys that's uh, my haul for now I'll probably have one more haul coming up craft wise um, before Christmas I bought some things from craft online but I'm still waiting for them to be delivered 
so that's it guys thanks for watching what is your favorite thing that I have here you know what my favorite is and it's it's big it's the um, tacky glue I got because it's practical and I use a lot of it so anyway guys take care look after yourselves and we'll see you in the next video bye for now